Hey everyone, it's Paige. We're in Myrtle Beach today at Dustin Johnson Golf School. We're gonna talk ball below your feet, ball above your feet. They have this really cool contraption that you can work on it. And like I've said before, you practice on a flat range. And so when you get on the golf course where there's tons of hills, different lies, get a little uncomfortable because you haven't practiced this before. But I'm gonna give you one really simple, easy tip that's gonna help you when balls below your feet and balls above your feet. So what I like to do is you put your front foot down the slope. So what's going to happen is the ball is, is normally going to move to the right side and you don't wanna do that. So you put your front foot down the slope to offset what's going to happen. So by doing that, I'm setting my stance more shut to have my um, club head come more from the inside and turn it over, which will create more of a draw, which will offset the ball going to the right. And so always remember front foot down the slope. So now you're in the position to, to hit a draw and also you do feel a lot more stable. If you're here, you feel kind of a bit on your toes, but with the split stance, you do feel really steady. Another really great tip here is to stay still. Don't try to have too much movement or try to make the ball do something. Just try to stay as steady as possible and you don't even really have to think of anything else because your stance is already set up for a draw and your body will just already know what to do. So remember, front foot down the slope. And then when the ball is above your feet, you wanna put your right foot up the slope. This way you're gonna have an open stance because when the ball is above your feet, you tend to hook it. So this will offset this with an open stance. It's gonna push your path more from out to in and this will offset that draw and it will straighten it out. So just to recap, when the ball is above your feet, you wanna have your right foot up the slope. And when the ball is below your feet, you're gonna have your left foot down the slope. So I hope that is easy for you guys to do and you try it out.